Hi everyone, so I'm here to talk to you today about a little bit about Young Living Essential Oils and I, I kind of wanted to share um, some of my testimonies that have happened throughout um, the course of my time with Young Living. So there's so many, I kind of don't even know where to start. Um, so I've been with Young Living for um, a little over a year now. I started back in December of 2016 and um, I really had no intention of ever sharing about the oils. Um, I was super skeptical at first. I merely just bought a starter kit to support one of my friends that um, was hosting classes about oils. Um, this was, I thought it was just her side gig and I wanted to support her in that because that's just what friends do. Um, so, and then I started using the oils and my world was really turned upside down. Um, so I started off very slowly using my oils. Um, I was pregnant at the time with my daughter Ruby who is now six months old. Um, I also have a two and a half year old son Henry. So because I was pregnant and I wasn't too sure about these oils, I was kind of slow to start. Um, and it wasn't until about six months in, now this is uh, shortly after my daughter Ruby was born, um, that I jumped on their Essential Rewards program, which is a monthly customizable auto shipment. So up until that point, I was really trying to use my oils very minimally. Um, I had just spent $160 on the starter kit and obviously back then um, I had no idea the value behind the cost of the kit and how um, what we were getting and so in the very beginning stages of my journey with Young Living um, I was trying to really get the most out of these little bottles and by that I mean I was using them very minimally to try to extend the life of the oils and um, I will tell you that that is not beneficial for you at all um, consistency is key with essential oils um, and I personally um, I trust Young Living do your research when you are um, looking into buying essential oils Young Living has the highest quality standards in the industry. They have what they call the seed to seal promise. Definitely do some research on that. It's pretty incredible. Um, the extensive testing that goes into um, not only the uh, products, meaning the um, the crop that they cultivate for these oils, but even before then, just the land that they, they grow their crops on. There's extensive testing throughout the process. They own their own farms and distilleries across the globe. Um, it's pretty incredible. The company, the heart behind this company is unlike anything I've ever seen in my life. Um, so uh, where was I though? I kind of got sidetracked there. Anyway, so my journey, um, I was slow to start, like I was saying, and um, I really started seeing a difference with my oils when I started using them consistently, the way they're meant to be used. So essential oils differ um, very much so from modern medicine. So with modern medicine, we're used to taking a medicine to um, treat a specific symptom. But with essential oils, we um, are using natural remedies to support an entire system, which gets to the root of the issue. So in that it's it's very different in that you're not gonna just use an oil because um, you want to treat something um, you can start supporting your system to work your body through certain things but it's not treating a symptom it's supporting an entire system so very different um, kind of gotta um, do away with the mindset of okay so like Advil you know you take one every I don't know what six hours or so I don't know I don't I don't use Advil I don't use any if I can avoid taking medicine, I will. Um, but so this, like you can use essential oils as frequently and consistently um, as you need. Um, so when I started doing that, when I got on essential rewards, that's when I, you know, I was going to be using them every month. I was dedicated to using them every month um, and really... I, I don't know. I, I just a switch flipped for me. And I was like, I, I need this. We, we need to make this work. Um, and we did that and 
Um, it's pretty incredible what has happened to us since then in so many different ways. Um, so I'll start with uh, Thieves essential oil, which is great for immune support. Um, this that's one that came in the starter kit um, And that is definitely one of my most used oils. Um, it's a blend of clove lemon eucalyptus um, Clove lemon eucalyptus rosemary and cinnamon and it gets its name from I think it was medieval times in France There were these thieves that used to rob the dead and dying um, and in order to support themselves and not catch things they um, use this blend of herbs and those same herbs are what are in the thieves essential oil um, so that one we use that consistently every day um, on myself my husband my kids my two and a half year old son and my six month old daughter we put it on bottoms of our feet and our spine back of our neck um, every day to support our immune system and um, it has definitely supported us especially with everything that's going around in the fall winter months um, that is such an important oil for us um, so in that we also use it when like things come up for us um, if you feel like a little tingle or um, I'll drink it in my tea every day um, great for immune support my husband I mean my husband my son goes to daycare three to four days a week and um, there was a time during the fall when a lot of the kids were getting some sort of nasty whatever um, there's certain things they can't say for compliance reasons but I think you get um, the gist of what I'm saying um, so he towards the tail end of Every, everyone had, you know, stuff for a while. Towards the tail end of that, he got a little sniffle. And we were done with it. Like, it, things don't really last more than 12 hours. Um, and I definitely have thieves to thank for that. It's, it's really incredible, you guys. Um, so that's one testimony of ours. Um, I've also experienced great skin support. I had um, really dry skin. Um, the winter that I first started with Young Living and one of the very first rollers I made included um, lavender, frankincense, and purification and I roll that on my face every morning, every night um, and my complexion is like much better than it has ever been. Um, I used to have like really dry flaky skin, um, I used to have like wrinkles under my eyes, like really dry, dry, I've always had dry skin. Um, ever since I was a kid really um, and I know part of that is making sure to stay hydrated but even even without that I have found between that and um, now I use the Savvy Minerals by Young Living their foundation they have an entire makeup line as well um, I'm actually doing a class on that um, next Tuesday um, and they recently came out with the Savvy Minerals starter kits so that's pretty awesome. I'm super excited about that. I'm not a big makeup person, but I always I always wear foundation every day and I'm loving it. Um, I can't wait to get my hands on one of their kits. It's the most cost effective way to get the makeup. Um, but yeah, so skin support has been amazing. One of the most surprising things for me has been the emotional support that I've experienced by using the oils. Um, and that wasn't really ever, I mean, you know, women have their ups and downs. Like it, I feel like it's a normal thing, you know, that time of the month rolls around and um, we can get a little crazy. Um, it's just in our makeup, uh, unfortunately. Um, but I, so it was just after having my daughter Ruby back in July of 2017 um, that I, I had gotten on the Century Awards and really was using my oils fairly frequently. Um, and I notice incredible support you know with postpartum um, after you have a baby your emotions are all out of whack um, your hormones are all over the place I nurse um, my daughter as well so my hormones are still kind of all over the place um, and I found that I was always drawn to the tree oils so I love cypress pine northern lights black spruce um, frankincense I I crave the tree oils um, and it I it really helps me um, just stay balanced um, I this is very interesting so I I'm okay so I was always one to have um, a drink or a glass of wine at the end of a stressful day like um, so let me start by 
So my husband and I are, were both self-employed. Um, we were in corporate for five to six years. Um, maybe a little more than that. A little over six years for me. My husband a little bit longer. Um, so I, I know the stresses of being in the corporate environment. I was a claims adjuster. Um, in the subrogation department. So I had to argue with other insurance companies all day long. Totally not my personality. If you know me at all, that is so not me. Um, I like to be really non-confrontational. Um, and that was, that was, there was a lot of personal growth there for sure. Um, but it wasn't really the direction um, I wanted my life going in. And I was away from my babies a lot. And after I had my son, um, we made a change. Uh, we started an e-commerce business, which we're not gonna, I'm not gonna get into that, um, but we luckily are able to um, work from home, both of us, which is pretty incredible. It's been, it was what, October of, oh my gosh, 2016? October of 2016. So we were six months, six months, six months, I can't talk, into our e-commerce business. We were managing both while still working in corporate so that was a whole different season of life um, but we did it for six months until we got it to a point where we could leave our corporate jobs and you know sustain our lifestyle um, and support our family so um, it's been since October of 2016 that we've been doing that full-time and it was only two months after that that I was introduced to Young Living um, never thought about the business side of Young Living whatsoever wasn't on my radar never wanted to do that never wanted to be one of those people um, and here I am and <laughs> um, so that's a whole other story but I feel like they came into my life at a time when I needed them most and I, I had no idea I feel like this path was set for me by God uh, well before I even had the idea in my head he knew exactly um, what path that I was meant to be on um, and it's it's been pr a pretty incredible journey um, and that's a whole other thing I don't know why I started talking about this um, but I know I was mentioning okay so stress um, I used to um, even with being self-employed after a long stressful day um, I was always one to have a glass of wine or a drink after work um, just you know decompress from the day I feel like that's pretty normal you know it wasn't a problem just you know you have a drink after work after a stressful day okay since using my grounding um, tree oils that I love so much I because I feel so much more balanced I rarely ever will even crave a drink like I like usually if it's maybe a social thing and like you know we're having a party for a friend or whatever um i'll drink socially but i i don't really care for it i, I really don't um i don't really like where it takes me uh it's kind of counter counterintuitive like you're stressed out you have a drink after work you think it's gonna like calm you down but you know it, i don't know to each their own i i, I I'm not against it, obviously. I just, that was very surprising for me, unexpected. That wasn't something I was looking for support in. It just sort of happened that way. It was, it was pretty incredible. It is pretty incredible. Like I said, every day these oils surprise the heck out of me. Um, also, another crazy thing, I have always gone to church since I was a kid, um, but I feel like I was always just kind of going through the motions. Um, and not really being super connected to, to God and, and what I was going to church for. Um, I, I was just going through the motions, really. Um, and it wasn't until starting to see something bigger with these oils. Um, they are, I feel like, so much more connected to the earth. Um, these oils, these essential oils, come from plants that God placed here on this earth and getting back to that to the root of you know creation and God and um, I feel like he sees that so many of us are lost so lost um, with all of the things that we struggle with um, we've kind of lost our way and 
or losing focus on on what's most important in life. Um, so that 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 came out of nowhere for me, um, and just reconnecting with him um, through this journey has been incredible. Um, seeing that I, it's just opened my eyes to like there is a bigger picture here, um, and getting back to that has been. Uh, an incredible process and I I put him like at the forefront of my life now and that that is a huge change for me um, my husband and I study the Bible now um, I I was never that way ever um, even going through a Catholic up upbringing I um, yeah I don't know how to explain that but this all started from my journey with the oils and I'm amazed day in day out I am amazed I yeah I <laughs> there's so many things um, today for example so I through Young Living in our community that I'm a part of through our Facebook groups um, we get to connect with these women all over the world and um, I'm part of this oil of the month club and so each month there's a specific oil um, dedicated to that month and if you want to be a part of it you buy that oil and you use it um, for consistently for 30 days and then you come back and you share your testimonies and so this month February that oil is white angelica for um, I'm part of the baby steps team with Courtney Greitz um, so this is part of uh, something that she's doing within one of her groups. So this is White Angelica, and this is great for emotional support. Um, a lot of um, emotional support and um, supporting times of grief. So this came out of nowhere for me. I, I had this oil for, and I got it in my Essential Rewards order this past Saturday. So what a Today's Tuesday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. I've been using it for four days consistently. Um, I can't wait until the 30 days is up to see even more change in me. Um, but I had an incredible experience today uh, in processing grief. Uh, I lost my grandmother. Um, I was very close with my grandmother. I lost her this past May. Um, so we're coming up on almost a year. February, right? March, April, May. Three more months, it'll be a year, wow. Um, so I feel like a lot of people process grief differently. Um, a lot of people will kind of hide it away, um, which is really not good for us um, to internalize that energy. Um, so I, we were sitting in the movie theater today, so my husband and I celebrated um, Valentine's Day today because Tuesday is the one day that both my son and my daughter are both at daycare. Um, my daughter only goes one day a week. She's so teeny tiny still. Um, so we decided to celebrate during the work day today rather than trying to get a sitter tomorrow night um, because everybody is probably going out for Valentine's Day. But um, so anyway, we went and saw The Greatest Showman, uh, which is an incredible movie. As soon as it started, I was like, oh my gosh, I'm going to love this movie. One of, I have to say, one of the best movies I have ever seen in my life. Um, the message behind it was incredible. So uh, I'm sitting there and like I'm using my oils throughout like every, you know, throughout every day I've been like smelling it, putting it on my wrist, you know, over my heart, um, diffusing it, my diffuser. Um, and just kind of, she started coming up on my mind and like everything I was seeing and everything that was around me. Um, I was seeing her everywhere, um, just in, you know, seeing older people and thinking of her and, I don't know, just taking it all in and remembering good moments I've had with her and I think it, it's it's been really healthy for me so far to um, really just like meditate on her and, and think on her and I'm not intending to, it's just, it's coming to my mind, it's something that my body obviously knows that I need um, to grieve her, um, and I feel like I, I, I did that, um, 
but there's always I mean there's always things that you internalize and and um, I'm kind of looking forward to to what else comes up with this um, with using this oil I'm only four days in so things like this, so many incredible things that have happened to me um, through this process of using the oils that are just unexplainable beyond some higher power and God and I don't know, I don't know. It's pretty crazy. So anyway, I just wanted to share that with you guys. Um, if any of you want to learn more, I have classes every month. Um, I have virtual Facebook classes. If you're local, I also have in-person classes. I love to meet with people one-on-one -on -one and make that personal connection. Um, I feel like it's much more intimate that way. We can really um, get to know each other and get to know um, what what your needs are. I also can do um, virtual FaceTime one-on-one -on -one with people. Um, this is something I just, I fell in love with. I'm so passionate about. I feel a strong need to share this with the world. Um, and yeah, like I said, I never, I never, ever, ever thought that this was gonna be part of my journey. Um, for me, it's it's been really about building relationships with people and helping people in more ways than one because uh, I've seen so many things that they've done for me and my family and just wanted to share with you guys. Alright, take care.